Let's go. It's underway. Season two starts right now. We know how dangerous RL Scout can be on the field, uh, especially after we saw him uh, just in the tryout. It was ridiculous how well he was doing. Oh, what a put oh, down! I him as I'm telling his name. RL oh. Scout puts it dagger already. Bar down on top of Astro. It's one nothing commitment issues. What a fast shot. My goodness. Astro going for the double. Barely misses it, passes it to a teammate. It's off backboard. Now kept in possession. Can they break through? There's one on one right now. It's pushed to the corner and. Commitment issues will get a free clear after taking a ridiculous amount of time, it seems. Yeah, you're seeing some mistakes with the pressure on the pitch already. You saw some bumps, team bumps coming through, and some missed touches, but those kinks will be worked out as we get going here. They'll get comfortable, they're trying to play at their own pace here. And we'll see who's able to, oh, and as you see another team bump there, we'll see who's able to get it going first. Just fire. In the center, eh? It's out in the middle. Down to beat ups. Play a shot and beat ups. Lots at home, top bins. It's a great pass out, forcing two defenders. Unfortunate double commit, two on the backboard. Kind of spreading out by the team, but we're tied up. Ricker. Just fire. And a long clear down, staying with it. Arl Scout taking it up the field. What's he gonna do with it? It's a one on one. Puts it's it wide. wide. Frostfire gets a good pass off to Astro. Astro shoots oh. it high and off bar. I like the team plays coming out, putting it across to each other. As long as they can cross them up and force uh, extra commitments like we saw in the last play, mm -hmm. you can definitely convert. Pretty much. Here comes another shot. Oh, it's off the par. Almost an own goal there. Astro oh, coming in with a demo. He's getting put center by beatups. Crossfire can't connect. Back into the offense. Stops for the boost instead. Here comes Astro putting a shot on net. It's weak. Now here comes Beatups putting a center. Here comes RL Scout. He's getting a clear out, but there's no teammate there. It's just going right back out into no man's land. Crossfire oh, and it's a and miss. And that's a shot. Astro. Bottom right corner. A miss on the back wall there by Tricker. Very bad misread. Allowed that ball to slip right through the defense. Get that bottom right. And he puts his team up 2-1. And yet again, uh, I've been seeing commitment issues have a strong kickoff, but then the follow-up is just always late. I feel like that's just what reduces the pressure, but uh-oh. Oh, and it's oh! oh! There it is again, and it's in! Ricker, there for the cleanup. Oh. Scott doing all the work to put it by the two defenders. Uh, very, very close to being a, a squandered play there. Yeah, again, commitment issues have a better kickoff. I feel like that's going to determine who, obviously, who gets the offense first, but who can maintain pressure. But Europeans always find the follow up right off the kickoff, which they have. It, that's when they get tons of pressure and some boost starving coming out in the midfield, especially. I would like to point out the nice use of a Dominus for once. I feel like you don't see that too often. Along with background, I think using the Sylvia. Or is that the Charger? Uh, let me see. I think it's the Charger, otherwise I'm not very familiar <laughs> with the... <laughs> Uh, you don't, stuff. yeah, you don't see it too often. That's bar, shot off the Ooh. bar, back out the background, but cleared away again by B-Dubs. B-Dubs has not been 
seeing much of him on the offensive end things. There's only one save by Europe-based Europeans. Commitment issues have put five shots on net and only two made it through. One save from based Europeans and the rest is just bar. Yeah, I'm gonna say that that car is probably the um... Hello? Oh, hello? The demo? <laughs> oh. Are we supposed yeah, to bye. stream it? Uh, why are you here? <laughs> Are you here? We're casting. <laughs> We're casting right now. Get get out. Casting, get bro. out. Get. Get. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> get. Get on out of here. I don't know what that was about. Oh, well, RL Scout just said it. to go. Oh my gosh. <laughs> here comes RL Scout. He's just hammering by all the defenders, but B Dubs gets it pretty clear. He's not in a no man's land. Or B Dubs beats him to it. Oh. Here's our all sky. Everyone's very awkward. There's always so much space on the pitch, it feels like, rather than most games I've seen. Well, I think that's first game, first stream game, live nerves. They're getting to these these guys, so give them a little time to warm up. By game three or two, they'll probably be all good to go. Yeah. It, do, the clock. it do look like we have overtime here, unless Commitment Issues has something to say about it. As oh, that ball up. is cleared towards their end, and background will let it drop smartly. For overtime first game of the entire year. That's awesome. Hope it's long so we get some, you know, we get some action. Who's going to be that player that gives their team the first win of season two? Who will be that man to step up to the role? RL Scout looking to do it, but Astro denies him. Here comes Tricker. Oh, Tricker! Oh, what a shot! He gets it to go! Passed to himself off the waterfall and doubled directly in in front of B Dubs' face. See ya later. B Dubs, who was awkward to that one, he was in net. Nobody was on backboard to cover it. Tricker had a wide open net essentially for that shot. Commitment issues. Get game one. That was a great game to watch. Awesome mistakes on both sides. In the end, it was a very even match. Very even. That was great game played all around. Uh, I want to point out that Tricker, the resident champ three, of commitment issues not the GC1 had led his team to a victory there with two goals now seeing how that game went what do you think based Europeans needs to improve on besides the very obvious kickoffs Europeans they've been finding each other more on the field but I feel like they leave way too much space we've seen awkward moments where there's just five seconds of commitment issues just sitting there on the other end of the field waiting for commit uh from based Europeans. So the commitment issues are on the opposite side of the on the opponent side of commitment issues. So that's ironic. <laughs> you had me confused over here. RL Scout in the air looking for a pass to trigger, but oh. oh barely gets a touch on it is Frostfire and he keeps based Europeans in game one to start off. It's a fire right off the bat. RL Scout Pushing into the corner, no one's there to meet it. He's gonna try to put a center, but beat ups. Just said by RL Scout has to retreat now. Here comes Astro. This is up the wave dash, gives Tricker some time to get across, but here comes a shot. It's off the bar once again. RL Scout. Oh, what a flick oh, by yeah, RL flick. Scout. My goodness. Maintain this pressure. You know how awkward Serpents can get to keep putting it off the backboard. Frostfire gets left with control of the ball with no boost. And a background just misses. But thankfully, base Europeans does not capitalize off of that demo. Frostfire alone in the back. Gets a good boom. It's not dunked. Comes background. In the corner, playing it very safe. Trying to go for a pop-up. Here comes Arl Scout. He's pushing it all the way downfield. Goes right back into Astro's possession. 
Yep. Astro with some good control, but a slow follow-up leads the ball right back into their zone. And an awkward ball here, but thankfully Scout does not capitalize and hits it off the back. And is that an open net? It's off to the side. A very, very close one. Commitment issues get away with one there. Fire. Almost gets it there. Cross Scout. Look for the carry. Gonna flick it by one, almost. B-dubs denies him. B-dubs. Nice going for the center. Um. Sure. Get very much power on it, and now it's just back on the other end. That ball was sailed wide. We're still looking to have the first goal of game two. Nobody's opened the scoring for us yet. There have been a couple chances that I feel were squandered at this moment as that ball gets dangerously back past there. Across both sides, there have only been three shots total. That is going how much action is going on in the midfield going back and forth. Now there is an intended oh, back pass that, yep, Frostfire got a shot on, but it was blocked by Scout. And it's another shot that could have been put on net, maybe, that might have squeaked through that it's just slightly off to the side. I feel Based Europeans has had a better chance of scoring here, but they've just not gotten the touches that they need. Especially Frostfire, he keeps being there for the shot. He has three, the only shots for his team, but... Just teammates can't ever find the follow-up. A good clear there by Tricker. Astro with a fake we're going to go with. <laughs> oh, what a bad touch. Hey, whoa. Ooh, puts, uh, puts B-dubs in an awkward spot. He had to try and get a touch off to the side, and it went nowhere. He did not get the touch he needed. And that ball will slip through. And commitment issues open the scoring yet again. It's 1-0. We just need some of that coming out from base Europeans because B Dubs and Astro yet to put a shot. The only players in the entire lobby not to put a shot yet. And in three and a half minutes of regulation, Astro taking his time with this wasn't a very good decision after the hesitation, but it gets cleared away. Frostfire has to race to it a bit. Oh, it dunks him. Oh, Astro putting off to the side. It's center though. Two players miss it. Astro misses it as well, but third man, Crossfire, pushing it across. He gets it to the corner. RL Scout. It's a Good very clear. booming clear, but it's right back into the possession of base Europeans. Yeah, we want more passing plays like that right there. You want to get more people some possession. Uh, just missed an air dribble bump there. That's the most dangerous play. It's, it's the hardest shot to defend, in my opinion. Out into the right, but gets cleared away once again. Based Europeans having have slow. a chance with pressure, but just no follow ups. They're having very slow reads as a bump. Oh, a a team, team bump. B dubs and Frostfire get tangled up. And as we're looking at it, it looks like commitment issues are just going to sail. To a game two win, and RL Scout will put it away. Put the dagger. Did expect a close series, but this has felt dominant from commitment issues this game. I don't know what Europeans have changed up, but it's clear the last game, they just feel like, yeah, they're not showing up. No, there's never a follow up off the clear. There's never a follow up after the initial shot. And there comes another whiff from the nerves. Mm -hmm. Good pinch to clear there, though. But time's gonna away, though. It's gonna go zero. As time's gonna run out for based Europeans, and already they're staring down the barrel, down 2-0. Need a reverse sweep to open the lead to win this one. Based Europeans definitely seem to have much more chemistry, but in terms of solo plays, commitment issues has been. Absolutely dominant, especially with Tricker in game one. Whew. Get a good look, boys. Astro was shut down this game with only 98 points. 
Last game, he was the best player on base Europeans. How are they going to be coming back from this seemingly extremely dominant play that Commitment Issues is uh, f f uh, playing? <laughs> Struggling at my words out there. Always find each other in the midfield at some point, but it just aren't fast enough and as soon as they bang it out which they've been doing more this game it just goes right into commitment issues uh, possession there's no one pushed forward i feel like if they have uh, have any chance of scoring they just have to hard push at this rate as their shots are not working game three commitment missed issues looking for a nice sweep right off the bat based europeans looking to come back and make history on game one. <laughs> game We're three underway. Almost gets that double tap off of the ceiling and the back wall. But you don't get a highlight real play that we wanted. We're waiting for that first clip of this year. We're looking for it. Well, we already have seen it. We had that tricker goal off of a waterfall double. That was a good play. I won't lie. It wasn't an absolute uh -oh. fire. Uh-oh. B-Dub's in an awkward he spot. He was able to get it away, though. Scout putting a center. Man, they're already. Around. Already, you can see, base Europeans is already in a hole. They can't get out of their own zone. Some good pressure kept up here by commitment issues. But base Europeans, they've been on the back end, but they've defended well so far. So in terms of their boost meters, it just feels like they've been well, most of this game. Astro on zero, running out on zero right now. And Crossfire getting dunked by two defenders. No! Across him, there's background for his first goal of the series. You cannot let that one fall through. I was right there. Astro hit it right to him. The, it's almost like it's an own goal. That's a rough one to have there, but based Europeans looking at another deficit that they have to come back from. Wow. I did not expect such a blowout so far, but there's still a chance for based Europeans. Mm -hmm. Just need to keep pressure. They don't have a single shot in almost two minutes into regulation. This is absolute dominance for based Europeans. Dominance for commitment issues. <laughs> oh, commitment issues. I am... I am just... <laughs> this is my first time casting in three months. Give it's, me a break. It's been a while. Yeah, it's been a while. <laughs> Ooh, another double whiff. A whifty whifty coming through. <laughs> and the next left oh, wide man. open! Next left wide open! B-Dubs goes for the hit there. Frostfire goes for boost, and I think he got bumped. Oh, that's why. Someone in the corner got a bump on Frostfire and was able to slow him down just enough to not get back. Commitment issues up 2-0 already. Have to see something come out here. B-Dubs, the Dominus man. He's going to take it up the wall. He's going to try to push his center. He barely misses it. Oh, this might be another Cross open net. Uh, might be an open net. Oh, what? A, no, what a Astro. save by Astro. Getting back in time. Astro. Coming back to Astro on the other end. He misses. Going for a bump. No. Oh. That was their chance. That was their way back in the game. Unfortunately, it looks like nerves got the best of them. And they still look down at this 2-0 hole. You have to convert that. You absolutely have to convert that. And especially two goals down, and they need this. They have to reverse yep. sweep the game, and they're just throwing. Oh, and there it and is. And there's another miss off the backboard in the RL Scout. What's in the dagger? Two minutes to go. Well, we need a miracle here. This is looking like it's the end of Base Europeans opening. Now, it's not fully done yet, but it's getting mighty close with our skill play here. With all of our skill levels, it's getting very close to being an impossible comeback. 
we have seen miracles, a lot of miracles before, especially down in these ranks. Oh! Oh, what a save by our scout! Based Europeans cannot buy a goal! They have to keep oh. pushing! It's gotta keep going! They just cannot get one to fall through. The back wall. There's a follow up from Arl Scout. It goes wide. Beat up. He misses it. Tricker trying to be there. Astro off the back wall. Pushes it across. There's a double commit on the play. Background. He doesn't have any boost to work with. Waiting for a teammate. Tricker going forward. Can he put the absolute ensuring dagger that there won't be a single comeback? Well, it gets denied. And here comes Beat Ups. Um, you're looking at a very bad spot to be in. Frostfire, but denied again. The defense of commitment issues, just as strong as the offense. Well, that was another chance that Astro could have put on net, but once again, he threw that other goal that he could have had just a slight touch again by Arl Scout, but he couldn't. And then he tried again, and it's just extremely wide. It would have been a fast shot that was put through, but. Yeah, that was right there. He gave the ball away to RL Scout instead of giving, taking possession. That's not what you need. And as we're looking at the 30-second mark, we're probably going to be chalking this one up here, folks. Still want some content, though. We need some mm -hmm. content goals. <laughs> Comes Astro. I try to put center. Almost. Beat up, puts it off, but oh, background denies goodness. again! They cannot get a goal, and for some reason, they're not playing. It's not very good. Um, that's they left before regulation even ended. Yeah, that's... They can't, they can't do that, no, you, we'll have to tell them later. You can't do that uh, for multiple reasons.